Now, what are we having for breakfast today, hon? Uh, we're having our normal breakfast compared to the sausage and cornbread and bacon. <laughs> we're having oatmeal for breakfast this morning. Oatmeal, okay, yeah, well, oatmeal's good. That's what we, we have actually, oatmeal this is, is our, normal. We usually have oatmeal. This is our normal breakfast. With, with raisins and you're gonna put some pine nuts in this yeah, morning. Yeah, we're gonna put some pine nuts in this morning. You know, I was remembering, Tristan Jones always wrote about burgoo, so, you know, I was thinking we might whip up a batch of burgoo just for the heck of it and see. <laughs> I remember, I remember you talking about burgoo when I first moved to Word. Never have actually tried that. We should probably try making some. And I got, let me hold on a second. Let me get the recipe up here on the computer. Um, well, I got the recipe for burgoo. Let me, I'll read it to you. You can tell me what you, it says burgoo is specially suited for cold weather passages as you get, as it can be stored top sides and eaten right out of the container. And so here's the recipe. It's prepare porridge and pour an inch layer in a container. Cover with a layer of bacon, another layer of porridge, then add a layer of beef. Alternate layers of porridge, beef, fish, and bacon. Lace each layer of meat or fish with a few drops of whiskey. <laughs> it says, in tropical regions, smaller amount is made. I guess that means because it won't last as long. But, I, you know. If the outer edges begin to turn moldy, they can be scraped away and the remaining burgoo can still be eaten. Ew. That was kept outside on deck, strapped to the mast, too, wasn't it? Right, right. This is uh, from Tristan Jones, One Hand for Yourself, One for the Ship, The Essentials of Single-Handed Sailing. <laughs> maybe we'll. <laughs> I think we'll stick with we'll skip regular the oatmeal and just today. Go with regular oatmeal for the time being. <laughs> I think that sounds like a plan. Ew. <laughs> okay, so it's a layer of porridge. Right? That's porridge. Could be oatmeal or or grits or cornmeal mush or something like that. And I think it would work better with cornmeal or grits. Uh, so Cover with a layer of bacon. Okay, I can go. I'm, I'm with you so far. <laughs> bacon. Another layer of porridge. Okay, so we're not unlike the, you know, the, our, our cornbread pie. Then a layer of beef. Except this isn't cooked. This is. Why? Well, well, it's got to be cooked. It's cooked, but then it's. The layers it's, have to be cooked. And then yeah. don't, you don't cook it after you put it together. Okay. Uh. Yes. And then alternate layers of porridge. So it's like you're pouring in oatmeal or, or, or grits. Porridge, beef, the fish, I just, fish and bacon, okay. And then pour whiskey in there with it. Yeah, but his passages were how long? And yeah, he was single-handing. And when you got tired or hungry, he would just go scoop some out of the barrel and eat it out of his hand on deck is kind of what I get the impression that he did. They didn't have canned did. beans in those days? Well, they were really expensive. I suppose. I suppose. So. But I'm trying to, I just can't imagine what we're, we may have to make some of this just to figure out what it's really like, but it doesn't sound. Appetizing. Okay, so Quaker rolled oats. Uh, you boil the water, you yeah. add the oats. You don't have to boil, you don't have to. You don't have to actually have to boil actually the water. Cook we don't have to actually cook it. You don't actually have right. to cook it. When I first met you, you were just pouring hot water in a bowl of... Yep, oatmeal. just regular regular rolled oats and uh, add boiling water, cover, let it sit for a few minutes. And that, that way it works just doesn't well. get all mushy. And then we add to that some pine nuts, some sliced banana, some raisins, maybe a little cinnamon, some maple syrup. And... Uh, Makes a mighty fine breakfast. But that's our normal breakfast, and uh, it's just quick and easy kind of thing, and there you go. Not as weird as burgoo. <laughs> <laughs>